54,000 people watching West Ham. <laughs> Brilliant. I didn't expect so many here tonight. Yeah, I thought that Berlin eventually would be a wrap around itself, you know, but this came up and we're lucky enough to have it, aren't we? Yeah, yeah, it did feel a bit weird coming off the exit pretty far instead of going down towards the bowling, yeah. A few more people in there should be able to bring the same sort of atmosphere, shouldn't we, hopefully? So, hopefully. Everything feels strange. The whole thing feels alien, but really exciting. Look at the space the kids are kicking the ball around. We were never able to do that before. Well, I'm third generation. My granddad actually went over the wall at the very first Wembley Cup final in 1923. He lost a leg on the underground and still managed to get there. So I carried it on. They're no longer with us, but we have our stones over here with the family names there. And we've got the whole family here represented. So the whole thing is a new generation, new life, new beginnings. It must have felt strange not heading for Upton Park tonight. Really strange, going through a shopping centre and there's so few West Ham fans and there aren't real old uh, jelly deal shops and things, it's, uh, it's very, very odd. Oof. Hopefully a victory. As long as, we, as long as we still play well here, I don't really mind, but it's very, very sad about Upton Park. You know. <laughs> yeah, um, it depends who these extra 20,000 odd fans are. I mean, the regulars who went to Upton Park, although they're not as vociferous as they used to be, I mean, they were still really on top of it and great fans. I just hope they're not 20,000 fair other fans who are going to be the extras coming, but uh, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, I mean, this is my 15th year as a season ticket holder, so it's weird after all these years, but kind of, I go with that train line to work every day, so to sort of seeing it gradually turn more from what it was four years ago to what it is now, I feel like I'm ready for it now. Like after the way we bowed out of the Berlin last year, it was perfect and it was the right time. We are in the bowling noise here, I think our fans are so incredible everywhere, at like home or away. I think, yeah, yeah. 54,000 of us, more so. I'm hoping the atmosphere is going to be the same and I'm hoping that we're going to see some really good football. It's the fact that I, um, I've been to the Paralympics. Um, it's just the, how big it is. It's really cool. And you look at, do you think? It is, yeah. yeah very strange. Yeah. Um, been looking forward to it for a while now. So it's nice to finally come here. Uh, yeah, a bit strange. <laughs> yeah, I think that's yeah. what people are most worried about. We're not too sure. We've seen all the pictures and we know it looks great, but not too sure if the atmosphere is going to going to be the same or if it's going to be uh, a bit quiet so it'd be interesting to see how it goes tonight yeah. I think. A, li a little bit yeah it's um, a tad like Wembley way I feel um, but it's yeah it's incredible incredible really I'm really looking forward to it it's going to be a, a great night hopefully we'll get the, the win. The initial reaction you know I remember my first time at Upton Park you know four or five years old um, that feeling so I'm just looking for that back of the neck hair standing raising feeling so no really excited we're looking forward to it so hopefully good win uh, no not really no we've been waiting for so long that uh, we sort of we've been waiting for this moment for a long while I suppose not that we wanted to come in the first place but we knew it was happening uh, Is that yeah what I think I say? think I think it's gonna take probably a season or two to for people to find their feet here because we've all been split up you know when we're buying our tickets we're all over the place um, so a bit like the when Arsenal moved, it took a little while. Very different, yeah, very different. But sad as it was to leave, you have to move with the times, don't you? Really? And uh, yeah, looking forward to it. It's, it's a nice turnout, lots of claret and blue everywhere. So yeah, start of a new era. Since they put the roof on, they've said the acoustics are are pretty good, and the West Ham fans like a bit of a sing song. But Arsenal messed it up at the Emirates, didn't they? So you know, we uh, hope that uh, we can maintain the same.